All right, let's go to Shanbu and go to Where is he? There he goes. And how was you, sir? I think this is part four or three of a story. Oh, okay, it's three. The aerial arena is as lively as ever. I just can't get excited about it, though. <laughs> this sort of thing has always been lost on me. <laughs> Go some stones. Ah, so you're the hot-blooded type, huh? I bet you and Leia would get along great. Heidi ho Nova here! Got a line on a monster eradication job. You want it? Don't answer. I don't care. You're taking it. It's actually kind of a big deal. There have been civilian casualties on everything. So go get them, tiger! And don't feel obligated to thank me for the hookup. Although, I wouldn't turn down flowers or a free lunch. No. Nope. Anyway, no time for that now. You need to get your butts to Labari Hollow by, like, yesterday. Good luck! Get out of here. What about dates? <laughs> All the money I give you? I'm guessing that was Nova. Mind if I tag along? We've been looking everywhere since she vanished, but still no leads. I'm tired of twiddling my thumbs. I want to get out and do something. I approve. A little action is good for you. I'll lend a hand too. It's a lovely day to kill monsters. Mm hmm. That train schedule you gave me is really fascinating. The more I read it, the more I understand how deep and complex these railway systems are. Okay. And I keep forgetting to use the, um... The friendship potions. The way down is this way. Oop. Almost missed that. What the of hell? course, that has to be it. Then with spyrites, if we use this formula. Hmm? Uh, I just had an idea related to my research. I wanted to get it down before I forgot. Sorry, didn't mean to surprise you like that. <laughs> A love letter. <laughs> I wonder what would happen if I said that. You know, you really are a nice guy. Huh? I mean, in the sense that you're just naturally considerate. You always understand what I'm trying to say. It's like we're already old friends. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I know. How are you supposed to respond when I say something like that? Sorry. Forget I mentioned any of this. <laughs> are we having a bromance here? Look, someone's here. We better warn them about the monsters. To have gotten how far? Where is the person? I think sh that person, he or she, have. Uh, what do you call this? I think they noticed the monsters. Okay, it's this way to go. Yeah. Oh, there's that monster. Hmm. You know what? I'm not even gonna fight it because that's 175,000. 175,000 is not something I should be playing with. And I'm on level 48, so I'm not even gonna try that until I'm like level 60. Look at you. Taunting me. I'm so tempted to whoop his ass, but I'm not.
Oh, bag attack, how? Let's be sure to keep this up. I think there wasn't a lot of monsters to battle. Who's this person? Oh. Luger. They're like, oh shit! This is the threat, no for me. Let's wrap this up quickly, everyone. Yeah. Crushing ball! Alright, now I know what that noise is. It's the AC going up. We defeated it before there were casualties. Good job. Nice. <laughs> you got stronger. Wave smasher. I can't thank you enough. They came out of nowhere. I almost bought the farm, and without a single heart herb to show for it. Talk about tragic. You were looking for heart herbs? You're in the wrong place for that. You're better off searching closer to the Mon Highlands. You're kidding. I must have taken the wrong path from Shandu. No wonder everything looked so unfamiliar. <laughs> Wait, don't I know you? You're Dr. Jude Mathis, aren't you? Uh, yeah, that's me. I knew it! My husband is taking part in one of the clinical trials of your new Spyrite device. Oh, mm. I had no idea. Please tell him I'm thankful for his help. Never mind that. Why did you cancel the trials? Oh, that. It was hurting spirit. The device was really helping him, too. We couldn't believe it when they insisted he stop using it. My husband is strong. He'll get by without it. But we're certainly not happy about the situation. Once well. you get used to doing something the easy way, it's hard to go back, you know? Hmm. Ah, so the heart herbs are for your husband. If you're really grateful for our participation, then why not just let us use the device again? Nothing would make me happier. But unfortunately, we discovered a defect in the device. A defect? When will it be fixed? Well... Don't tell me I'll need to keep gathering herbs for the rest of my life! Woman! Please calm down. What? How dare you? I am perfectly calm, young man. No need to get angry with him, ma'am. I take full responsibility for stopping the clinical trials. We're doing everything we can to improve the devices. We just need a little more time. Please, will you bear with us? Well, I suppose I can hold out for a little while longer. A lot of people are counting on you, Dr. Mathis. Don't let us down. All right, you're privileged. She certainly made an impression. I guess I was a little overwhelmed, but I'm sure lots of other people share her feelings. Anyhow, we have a lead. I can't spend time moping. If I can just find Celsius again, I think I'll have a chance at the answer. I need to get back and review all the info just one more time. I can't give up now. Hopefully, um, Celsius will have the answer to his spyrite technology thing. Kitty has returned. Kitty has returned with what? Kitty? That's it? Wow. Kitty. You I hope you find Kitty? something. All right. You know what? I'm not going to fight that. I have a feeling I'm going to get rocked. So I'm not even going to consider it. And I know there was uh... Alright. I'm 
gonna go here, probably go to another area. But before that, let me buy some items. enough and I already paid for the story as you can see where was it that I can go oh that's right the Fenmont Sea Haven and I'm guessing this is one of the areas where I can go to um wow Fenmont it's been a while and it still has the night climb nice uh, let's see. Fenmont is another story. Um, and this is the other area that I might need to get to. So where's that story? Oh, the Order Palace. All right. And I know the Order Palace is where one of the cats are. Most likely the cats will be around here too, so I need to pay attention to them. They'll appear when you most... No, not yet. These people have not moved from part one. <laughs> wow. Yeah, these cats went everywhere. Oh, they're not here. Let me not dwaddle around. All right, that's right. I got something. Nah, I still like it. See if I get something. Oh hell no! Oh nice. All right, you. I'll make you nerdy. How does he look with um? It looks cool like that and you of course you're going to have Mila's replica bank all right with the hair pulled back and the hair all right that's pretty cool right, let me get out of here and I can open up more areas Which way is the Arglin Quag? That's another area I need to go to for... Alright. And this is the Order Palace. Yep. Okay, who's the person I need to talk to here? Most likely Leia. Oh! Muse! Muse has a story? Interesting. What say you, Muse? <laughs> With the bunny kids on her head. The spirit radio. Hmm. Why, whatever would you want to talk to me about, Luger? Me and you hooking up. Let's do some tethering. Don't be an asshole. Do you wish to tether with me? <laughs> oh my, what's a girl to do? Uh, I don't like this lady! Old enough to get jealous, are we? What if I let you tether with me as well? I've never tethered with two people at once before. Sounds like fun. You're adorable. Oh, she freaky. Enough with your teasing. <laughs> I oh, forgot about yes. that. Is something the matter? 
There is one thing I need to know. How did you return to the human realm? I don't know. How did you? The power to cut through space-time. I lost the blade, but its power was mine to begin with. If it's just me alone, I can still transport myself between the spirit and human realms. Hey, Luger! Balin! Hello again, little lady. Still as little as ever, I see. <laughs> Kids don't just grow up overnight. I thought scientists were supposed to be smart. Ooh, <laughs> not as smart as you, obviously. I'm just on my way back from the Laforte Research Center. One of the fellas there is researching communication between humans and spirits. You should go help him out if you get a chance. You're a spirit, right? Hmm? Me? If his research pans out, humans and spirits would be able to communicate from their respective realms. Hmm. I bet our buddy Jude would be pretty happy about that. Yes. Yes, indeed. Oh? Mesmerized by my beauty, are you? <laughs> Very well. I'll help out. Really? Oh, that's great news. You're kind of intimidating, so I was afraid to ask. But now I'm glad I did. Go talk to Nigel at the Laforte Research Center. He'll get everything set up. Good luck. And that's well, what one then, of the cats is, too. Let's go see this, Nigel. Oh? His research interests me. Then to the Laforte Research Center we go. Come along, everyone. Muse possesses the power to travel across space-time. She may well be the only spirit capable of crossing between human and spirit realms at will. Hmm. That is true. Hold on, what glasses? I gave him those glasses. Now I'm being picky. Alright, um... Okay, I gave him those glasses, alright. He looks good like that. Um... Go to the Lafont Research Center. Oh, and look, Bernard High Road is right here, so most likely I will be... I will be visiting these areas and doing the jobs. Off camera, of course, feeding the monsters. But I will be doing the, the cats and beasts on camera. Where's Nigel? I'll have to go all the way around and remember that. Well, I could have gone through the middle. I feel stupid. is a nymphomaniac. Well, if she was human, she would be considered a nymphomaniac. She was specifically talking about tethering with two people. You know what that means. Three sub. Huh? Who are you? Pardon me. Where might I find Dr. Nigel? I'm not sure if I'm allowed to share that information. Maybe I could persuade you. And, you know, I'm kind of in the middle of researching spirits myself. Well, if you tell me what I want to know, I'll let you research me as long as you want. Whoa, girl, hold your horses. Huh? Hey, Luger, I can't see! What's wrong? Not interested in a spirit's physical form? Which part of me would you like to research? Whoa, why did they show it? Let's start here. 
You humans are so naughty. <laughs> it oh seems Dr. Goodness. Nigel has gone to Arkland Quad to perform some field work. Hmm. Does Muse's behavior surprise you? No. She's much easier to get along with now. <laughs> oh, she's so freaky. She is so freaky. Alright, head to the Arlen Quag to go to Nigel. Girl has her way. I like music. <laughs> She's just so open. Interesting. And I forgot, where is the cat located in this area? In a research room. All right, let me find the cat. What the hell are you doing here? Just chilling. Most likely in a research room around here. I hear it. Where are you? Are you petting the kitty over here? I hear you. I hear you, but I can't. Oh, there you are. Oh my god. Now, no leave. All right. I found the leave. Don't touch your stuff. Don't touch your stuff. Oh, break it. Get electrified. All right, I found the cat in Fenmont Research Facility. Uh, let me mark that just to make sure so I don't um, confuse myself. And let's go to Arkland Quag. This way. Let me give the cat um Oh, they found the other kitty. I don't know there was another cat there. Stained glass fragments and I hope you Yep, I'll be doing these when I come back. To Arkland High Road. Nope. Oh, I am going the right way. Okay. And I don't think there's any more stories. Here we go. And they said the cat was near you know, a large puddle on here. Even though we went our separate ways. I still feel so comfortable around you. Isn't that weird? It's not as if we became entirely different people. That said, hearing you say that is not unpleasant. <laughs> you happy. You happy. Potato salad. The cat was near a puddle somewhere. I'm guessing there's a lot of puddles around here. 
Let me just check that on that later. The cat's not on here. Maybe another puddle over here. Maybe this large puddle over here? I don't need to change my arts too. I know I gained a couple of more arts. Over here, real quick. What was that? Forty five? Wait, I hear a kitty. There you are, drinking water. Nice. Okay, that's kitty. Number 58, I think. No, 59. Okay. Here we go. What the hell are you doing out here? You're not getting attacked. Who could that be? I wonder if that's Nigel. You don't say, what the, f what are you doing, man? You think animals don't smell you? Look at this wonderful disguise. <laughs> oh my goodness. Are you Nigel? The one and only. Why? What's with the getup? Hmm? Oh, this. I'm trying to communicate with monsters. Looks cool, huh? Not at all. No. Well, I'm sure it gets the job done. Phelan asked me to help you with your research. Oh! <laughs> Are you a spirit? Yes. Well, obviously. This is fantastic! And you're totally willing to cooperate? Are you sure? Is there some reason she shouldn't be? <laughs> no, no, of course not. Forgive me. I'm just so thankful you're willing to cooperate with our research. I'll sit back to the Laforte Research Center and get everything ready. Come as soon as you can. You sure this is a good idea? Who knows? We're certainly getting our exercise today, hmm? This Nigel fellow is an odd one. Yes, he is. Don't worry. He's got nothing on you. <laughs> That's messed up. Easy. Oh my god, they just gave it to me. Well, you know what? You don't have to work so hard. Just go ahead. Take the shortcut. Hello, Nigel. Are you still got that shit on? Behold! The end result of all those years of research! The Spirit Chat Yakety Strap 2000! A what the bracelet? Hell? Not just any bracelet! I made it so I could chat with monsters, but it picks up the voices of spirits instead! Is this safe? So it's busted. Hey, sometimes science is busted. You should remember that, young lady. He just got cool all of a sudden. So, am I supposed to wear it on my wrist? No, not you. It's meant for humans, not spirits. Oh, really? Well, then why am I even here? When we contact the spirit realm, we'll need you to explain to them what's going on. We wouldn't want to tick them off. Hmm. Well, I guess that makes sense. Oh, 
I'll wear it. I want to see what happens. Hmm. I pray for your safety. <laughs> what, jealous? Anything happening, Luger? Can you hear any spirit voices? Oh my, what's a girl to do? Mila will be so proud of me if this works. She'll absolutely love me. I plan on doing whatever it takes to make you look up to me as your big sister. <laughs> Luger? What did the spirit say? <laughs> oh my god, that was crazy! Oh my god! Oh what my is that god. supposed to mean? Come on, did you actually hear voices or not? Nigel, explain what happened. Oh, I was afraid of this. Honestly, it's just a prototype. It still needs a lot of tweaks. Then you won't be needing us anymore. Come on, let's head back. Wait! There's one thing I forgot to tell you! Uh, why didn't you just tell us that in the first place? If you try to remove the Spirit Chat Yakety Strap 2000, you'll die! What? The bracelet will detach once the Calculatrix run their course, so don't fuss with it! That's a nasty device to be stuck with. I'm terribly sorry, Luger. This predicament is all my fault, I'm afraid. Yank that little gizmo off and he dies? No way! <laughs> hmm? Regardless of who's to blame, I think we can all agree to abandon this foolhardy idea. Oh, shit. Someone sees the inside feelings of the... Oh, my God, that, that took me... Oh, my God, that took me by surprise. Hey, guess what? If you douse your napple in soy sauce, it tastes a little bit like sea urchin. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness, that surprised the shit out of me, man. I did not expect that. That looked a little too insane. Oh, I like this music. Let me see. I like this purple one. Nice. I like this one. It goes with my bunny kin. So, all right. <laughs> I still can't get that shit out of my mind. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, let me go to Fenmont. Um. Uh. Oh my goodness. Um, let me see if there's any more areas that I need to go to, and I need to do something there. No, just go to the main story and defeat some monsters and put in some some requests in. So next video will be me finding more cats. Uh, this will be um, yeah, finding the cats and fighting some mo well, not fighting the the monsters. Just me finding some cats and putting in some jobs. Alright, here you are, sir. I didn't report that. Oh, there's the job in... I need Luger, Jude, Alvin, and Muse. Alright, um... Where's Alvin? Alright. I know I got one more cat. Here we go. Alright. I'm gonna go to the inn. Where's the inn in this place? It's ready the monster area. Alright. So what I'm gonna do is save here, go to the inn, and probably investigate in there to see if there's any cats or anything. Um save and then plan out what I'm gonna do first. If there's any um, monsters that I need to buy, uh, fight, and 
I need to fight uh, Elite Monster in Burner High Road and Forgana Mine. I'm guessing I can go to the Hana Mines on this side most likely and there's gonna be a lot of cats and there's one in Fazabel Marsh where so I'm guessing I can go through around this area too there's gonna be a lot of places to visit so um, most likely I won't have commentary on the next video um, but I hope you guys are enjoying the videos because I know I am enjoying this game so much there's so much random shit <laughs> thanks for watching